Hello everyone, today I'm just going to be talking about the uh, Vans Waco Mario Maria uh, OG Classic LX Slip-On in the Classic White and Records colorway uh, retailed for 86 uh, sorry, 65 pounds or uh, 80 dollars or 80 euros released in May 2021 so the box is pretty cool, it's, uh, it's a thicker vault box so they're more sturdier than the uh, Standard regular vans. They're quite uh, quite thick cardboard. Come with this uh, shell closing, which is um, a lot more durable and uh, a lot more secure than the normal vans boxes or the older ones. You can really put a lot of weight on these, and it's fine. You know, much better for stacking. Uh, it comes with this kind of older uh, tissue paper, like the uh, old made in USA vans did, and that's kind of what this um, what the current vaults are trying to be like. So it's got the old uh, skateboard logo, which is the current vault logo. So I'll show you the uh, slip-ons now. So there are three uh, slip-ons in this pack, three authentics and three shirts. I would love to get the shirts, have the same design as it, as well as the authentics, they all have the, the vinyl print. The shirts are ranged from like £400 I think, so I didn't go for those in the end. But they come in like a clean, kind of off-white, creamy white, you know, especially if you compare it to the, the true white of the sole. I guess they call it a classic white, so it's a slightly kind of off off-white colorway. Wako Maria is a kind of Japanese designer. They do um, a lot of pop culture inspired clothing and designs. They do a lot of collabs with lots of different clothing brands. They've even got their own record shop in Japan, which is um, I guess why they're going for, for records on the shoe. It's got a, a quite heavy canvas, I guess all the vaults use a quite heavy thick canvas. We've got the vault sticker here. Uh, this is some of the new vaults have the old vaults didn't have that. On the unsafe it's got vaults here written. See that. So you know they're vaults. On the other side it says a uh, Waco Maria, which is pretty rare frankly, you don't normally get stuff on the other side of the uh, band's tag for collabs other than like vaults, other than it says the same vault. We've got the uh, the hill tab on the back the vaults originals. If you don't know, I'll just um, compare these to, uh, to the older vaults. So this is kind of a quite an old beat up here. They're both the same size. It does look like um, these are slightly slightly wider opening on the old one, so I guess they're slightly closed off. Um, it doesn't have a lever. So this the older pairs had lever inserts in the hill, whereas this is like a vinyl. And it's not stitched in, so that might peel up eventually, which is a bit of a shame. These uh, these soles are slightly skinnier. Not sure if you can tell. They're slightly skinnier, so you might need to size up if you've got a wider foot. Uh, it features a really glossy, um, st kind of sticky midsole, which is kind of a harkening back to um, when they were made in the USA. I don't know if you can also tell, but it features a. Uh, yeah, I don't know if you can see it on camera. But it has like string in the uh, in the midsole, in the foxing ear, that's called like Osenberg, uh, which is like a type of rubber where it has the string in it and that helps it last a lot longer. That's something the old vaults didn't have. Quite a skinny shoe, so you, you might have to size up. But yeah, great quality shoe. Uh, these are all on sale now, so I guess if you want to pick up a pair now, now's the time to do it.